Welcome to the Canadian Scrapbooker Magazine web show. My name is Jackie. Today we're going to be adding color to your cork embellishments. Stay tuned. This was a fun make and take that uh, we created while visiting the Magenta booth at CHA in Los Angeles this past winter and we just had to bring it home to share it with you. Using a Q-tip for your applicator, put a few drops of alcohol ink on the end and if you've just seen that it came out kind of in a glob so I actually just rolled it along the edges so that it didn't get all over the place. And basically apply the alcohol ink onto your bird. And you can go off the edges, you can color outside the lines because this is a, a sticker that we're going to peel off. I'm using Ranger alcohol inks. And this dries really, really quickly on this cork. So you don't have to worry about getting it on your fingers. Now there is a trick to this magenta cork and it's peeling it off. The trick is to take away the negative part first and to leave the bird image on the backing. So we'll start off by peeling it away and we push down the image with our fingers so that it's left behind on the protective backing. And the reason why we do this is because it's, it's quite intricately cut and we don't want to rip off any leaves. Then this piece of cork that is taken away, careful so that it doesn't stick back, we can save it and use it for another project if we like, if we didn't color outside the lines, or we could throw it in the garbage. Too. There's also a little tiny piece inside there that I'm simply going to take out with my fingers. Now he's ready to take off nice and easily. We won't have to worry about the leaves ripping. And it's a tiny bit tricky. Just take your time. Scrapbooking is not a race. Peel those off. ready to go. In the center, this piece of patterned paper. And we're ready to create the card. The magenta self-adhesive cork was colored using Ranger alcohol inks. The stamp that you see in the background is from magenta, as is the patterned paper that the little bird is stuck to. The ink around the edges of the cardstock, or pattern paper I should say, is from Clear Snap. And that little tiny bit of gold glitter that you see around the edges, that's from US ArtQuest. It's pigment paint. For this layout, we colored the magenta self-adhesive cork a little bit differently. We used Clear Snap Fluid Chalk ink along with some a stylus to apply it directly to the cork. The pattern paper that you see on this layout is, are, is from Quick Quotes. I used a EK Success punch to punch out the little circles that you see at the top. I put some watermark ink and then embossed it with some embossing fluid all from Clear Snap to make it pop. The little tiny dots that you see are my favorite, the Robin's Nest Dewdrop. The ribbon in the background is, is also from Quick Quotes. The tag is from Glitz Designs. And those cute little alphabet stickers are from Carolee's Creations. The picture and the cork bird piece were popped up using Scrapbook Adhesives by 3L foam squares to give it that 
3D effect that we all love so very much. Want to win a prize package that includes great products from Quick Quotes, Magenta, US Art Quest, and The Robin's Nest? Visit our website, canadianscrapbooker.ca, and leave a comment under this webisode, Color Your Cork. Think outside the box and start adding some color to your cork embellishments. Until next time, take care and happy scrapbooking.